Hey people, what's up? So I'm about to review Animal Crossing for the Nintendo Wii. Now, I'm sure none of you know this, but I actually reviewed this game already. Back on my YouTube channel. Well, you're watching this on my YouTube channel. So anyways, here's what happened. I reviewed it. The review sucked. It was... Then I took it down. So I thought, I'm going to give this game another shot. To hopefully make this review a lot better. Okay guys, so this is Animal Crossing. Now, in case you didn't already know, the entire game is built around living a second life in this little virtual town. This is my virtual town. So you build a character, you can customize them the way you want. As you can see, my guy's wearing a Mega Man shirt, because Mega Man's awesome. And you've pretty much got to live your life, with a few exceptions. Now, hear this music playing right now. Believe me, this is pr pretty much the only song you hear throughout the game. You will hear different variations of it as night and day, or the day of the week, but it's pretty much always the same song. So I found a solution to that. Who knew that Michael Jackson and Animal Crossing go so well together? Well anyways, I've got another problem with this game. Why isn't there any offline multiplayer? There's loads of online multiplayer, but zero offline multiplayer. I mean, come on, really? I mean, like, what if I want to play offline with, like, a friend or something, or, I guess in my case, a robotic operating buddy? Look at Rob, he looks so sad. And my one last complaint is that there's zero autosave in this game. There isn't even a feature to allow you to save and then continue playing. It's only save and quit. And that the worst thing is this really weird version of Monty Mole. If you forget to save, he'll come out and give you a three hour tutorial on how to save again. Damn it. That was a bit of a different style for me there. Normally I, I say all the complaints at the end, but for some reason I felt like saying them all at the beginning. So now let's get to the actual review, which you waited for. So this is the city. This is the big new addition to Animal Crossing City Folk. So first off, over here, you have a special shop, which is totally exp expensive, and you gotta get a special pass to enter. You can buy some useless crap here that I don't care about. Then just beside here is the movie theater where you can buy three where you can buy up to four emotions, such as love, disinterest, laughter, and worry. This is the model room. I'm not going to bother to mention it, because it's ridiculous! This is Gracie Grace, where you can buy a whole bunch of expensive furniture. Auction House, which I don't have a clue what you do here. Changes the color of your shoes. Let's you get a new hairstyle, which I don't care about, because I got a Pikmin hat. And then tells your future. There you have it, guys. That was the review. I really hope you enjoyed. Rate, comment, subscribe if you can. Send new friends. Da -da 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 -da. You know the t You know the drill. And it was a bit of a different review considering the fact that I do my that I did my complaints, then I showed the city, and that's really it. Cause I felt that there was no reason to actually try and mention the actual Animal Crossing game. Cause it's the same as the GameCube NDS version. And there are hundreds of hundreds of other reviews out there. And I'm not trying to be a straight up reviewer right now. I'm trying to be something different. There you go. And in terms of the game, I think that it's more so Animal Crossing than with the expansion pack of the city. Because that's really what the city is. Like, if... I'll bet you anything, if the GameCube had downloadable content, content the city, the city folk part would actually just be downloadable content. Because that's what it really feels like it is. But still, if you haven't played any other Animal Crossing games, I recommend you pick it up. It's a very good cause world game. Yeah, Link, there I said it. Okay, whatever. 
So anyways, me and Link had this big discussion over what type of game this would be, a sandbox, a sandbox in a different setting, or a cause world. And short form is, I could go on for hours telling you what type of game this is, it's a sandbox in a different setting in a cause world category, there. Well anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed the review. I got Rob here, with a Wii Remote. I don't know, I just really wanted to show him off. Well anyways guys, I hope you enjoyed. See you next time.